guys, so we're back for another Dokkan Battle video, and today I'm going to be reviewing Super Saiyan 3 GT Goku. Now, it's going to be really good, and I'm going to make a cut here, so I'll hop into the event. Alright, I'm back, and so this is just going to see what his attack stat is going to be without any support, no, uh, no leader skill, no links, nothing. So, yeah. He's probably not going to do too much damage here, especially since it's tech, but like... Just looking at an attack stat, it's nice. I do this because, like, it's nice to see what they would do with, like, no help or anything. Alright, so let's see. After if I get his super off. Alright. 171k. That's pretty good. But, you know, for him not having any anything active. And then that a, a combo was pretty nice, too. But, yeah. After this, I'm going to bring him into an event which with, with support. So... Yeah, better get ready for that, and be right back. Alright, so we are back for it. <laughs> Alright, so we are back. So I'm going to bring him into the STR Goku Black event to see what he can really do. Alright. So I'm actually going to, um, this is probably going to be pretty good for him. Although he's going to be on the next rotation with, like, what, um, only 30% support. So, yeah, that'll be pretty neat. But yeah, I'm just so excited to get um, the Awakening Medals for my Gohan and Goten because, like, I'm just so close, but I just don't have it. And it's really painful because, like, I have them at 79% and I can't do anything with them. It's a real shame. Because, like, this is... The, um, this rotation is probably gonna one-turn him. So, uh, yeah. Okay, yeah, I was right. It was real easy. Okay, next stage. Alright, so this is him with most of his links active, other than GT, but that's just like a key link, so it's not a big deal. Alright, so, and that's, he's only getting 30% 30, 30 attack and defense, so yeah. Defense isn't really what I'm worried about for him, I just think that, um, you know, since he's kind of old, and I may be, uh, you know, kind of late on doing this, I don't remember, I don't know when he came out, but I know it was a while ago. But yeah, let's see what his attack stat's gonna be now. 1.075 million. That's really good. I mean, could be better, but with only 30% um, support, it's not bad. Can't complain, really. Because he's only getting 90% attack and defense. But really, he's getting 110% attack when he does a super attack. So, uh, yeah. Hmm. Alright. Yeah, I'm gonna try and put him and Super Saiyan 3 Bardock on a rotation because those guys are gonna do pretty good together. But yeah, Bardock is gonna be really useful since with his 40% attack when HP is 70% or below. So yeah, I'm probably gonna use him a lot in these showcases. I'm probably not gonna do these showcases that often because, you know, there's people like Truth and other people who, uh, you know, do this type of stuff. So this is just gonna, it's not gonna be a one shot thing, but it's not really gonna, you know, happen very often. I might do it if it's like a unit that I just rainbowed. Like, I do actually um, have another one I was thinking about doing, and that's Easy A, um, and that is Easy A Ultimate Gohan. So yeah, this is him with no support at all. So let's see, a uh, hundred and six, a hundred, one million six damage. That's not bad. Because, like I said, he's just kind of old. He's not, like, outdated or obsolete or anything. It's just that, because of how long it's been since he's came out, it's pro his attack stat isn't going to be like, oh, 4 million, uh, 5 million, uh, 9 million. But it's not a big deal. But yeah, this is just going to be an event that isn't too hard to do. And, yeah, obviously having um, LR, Gohan, and Goten on the team, they're probably just going to, like, wreck house. Because, like... They're just crazy. I really wish I can awaken them right now. It's so dumb that I can't too, because like you would expect them after another celebration, or at least the same celebration, they would be out since they're Dokkan Fest LRs and everything. It just it's kind of dumb. And now I gotta wait. Kind of sucks. All right, this is just gonna be the last turn, and then I'm gonna have to um then I'm gonna go into another event. And let's see, 1.1 <laughs> million, insane. All right, I'm gonna make a cut. I'll be right back. All right, so we are into, so we are 
into the STR cooler event. Now, this one is um, going to be a little bit more of a challenge since he's newer and with him lowering defense. Alright, this is a really good rotation right off the bat. This is He's not really getting support since I'm, you know, 70% or above. So, this is just going to be another turn without any real, you know, yeah. Um, 915 million. I'm uh, not million. Oh, that'd be a lot. 915,000 is a lot. Then with that nice additional, made, jump, made it jump up to 100. Not 100. 1 million. But yeah, he's like really solid. Now, taking a super attack, I wonder how good he'll be. Because this is just like a first stage. Alright, 78k. It, it could be better, but I'm not really complaining too much. And, alright, let's see. Yeah, I expected Bardock to just, like, destroy him. Bardock is, like, so good. He's, like, really old. He's, like, two years old, too, which is what surprises me the most. Alright. Let's see here. With this Super Saiyan Goku on the turn, it's probably gonna be pretty nasty. But, eh. I think he might be able to take it. Well, let's see. Oh, man. Yeah, I'm trying to um get a rotation of of Bardock's passive full passive activated and then um Super Saiyan not Super Saiyan Goku um on the same turn to see how high it could get. But yeah, I really hope um this is gonna be it would probably take forever for this to happen, but having Ultimate Gohan have an ECA would be great. Cause he's good. It's just that he needs defense. Cause he's just so unreliable with his defense and everything kind of gets beat really badly like if he got a hundred and twenty percent attack and defense that'd be nice but yeah he kind of doesn't but all right so i'm gonna skip to the sdr phase of this fight so yeah be right back all, all right so we are back now this is a pretty good turn this is the one i wanted so let's see what will happen i think i'll be fine all right 75k from him is pretty good i really can't complain Alright, let's see. Hopefully Bardock uh, can take these hits in this first slot. I really hope he can because, yeah, him. When he doesn't get a super attack off, he gets clapped. Oh, oh no! Uh, 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 oh, poo poo. 162? No, no! Oh, thank god. Alright, Rebellion Edge! Oh my god. I'm not gonna continue. Um, I'm just gonna get into it. Hop, hop right back in. Alright, we are back. So this is just another turn. I think I ended up changing my team a little bit to where I... Oh no, this isn't. I didn't change it. Yeah, that's just the same one. This team is good, but like... Eh. There are a few liabilities, I could say. Like... Um, this, uh, this ultimate Gohan, like I said, he's good, but, man, he just needs defense. Like, he actually kind of helped me out pretty, pretty well in the Hybrid Saiyan Super Battle Road, but other than that, I just don't really like using him. He's only at SA2 as well. Alright, let's see. Man, those two just, like, destroyed him. This won't do too much, right? Yeah, 30k, it could be way worse. They're still taking double digits for normals. And then, yeah, I'm also super glad I ended up getting LR Gohan, because I actually got him on a single, which was just the happiest moment of my life, because I spent so many stones. But, alright, this is, um, next stage. This is the turn I want, but I think to be safe, I'm actually going to use an item, because I kind of can't have what happened last time happen, because, like, it, it's not going to be nice. Alrighty. So, let's see. Man, almost three, almost three hundred thousand um, attack at the bottom for the little circles. That's pretty good. I don't really know what those are called, but I just kind of call them circles because I mean that's kind of what they are. And then your key is around it, so yeah. Three point two million. Oh my god. How much is this super gonna take? Well, it's okay. It already got reduced by forty percent, so it probably won't be too much. But like, still, like that was oh oh eighty two. Okay, wow. But like. What's his attack stat? Um, I wasn't able to see it, dang it. But, doing 1.4 million attack was really nice. And thankfully he was able to beat him. So yeah, I think I'm gonna try and get 
my highest attack stat for him, and then, you know, just, you know, end the video. Alright. So, here it goes. I think he's on the first turn. Yep. Alright, this is him with no, um, this is him without some of his links, like Limit Breaking Form, and, oh yeah, I forgot. I actually made a mistake. Uh, yeah. Alright, I'm just gonna hop back in. Hmm. Yeah, I'm gonna do that, but yeah, this is the team I was gonna do. Alright. This is gonna be a pretty dangerous team, since, uh, you know, the two supports I brought were, would kind of get slapped around, like, really, really badly, because, like, yeah. They're just gonna, like, they're gonna get booty clapped. Okay. So, is he on this turn? Okay, yeah, he is. Now, this is gonna be really good, although it's only with 40% attack and defense, but 40% is still a lot. And then he's also getting Fierce Battle, and yeah. I think he has every one of, I think he has all of his attack links active, except, no, yeah, he has all of his attack links active, but the only, but some of the key links he doesn't have, like, GT, because, like, you know, he doesn't really contribute to, um, you know, attack that much. Alright, 1.1 million. Wow. Like, he is really good. I'm honestly kind of happy that I got him because, like, I'm going to use him often for something, for stuff like Battle Road and, wow, okay, 42. But, uh, yeah, he's just kind of really solid. That's the best way I could put him. He could be a little bit better. Like, if he got 100% attack and defense, then that'd be nice. And maybe, like, too key, but, eh, I don't want to be picky. And then his leader skill is kind of interesting. Because, like, he's going to get an easy A sooner rather than later. And then when he gets his easy A, easy A I'm, I'm going to make a video about him. So, yeah. It's going to be like an update. Because easy A's are just like lifesavers. Especially since me. Since I'm as broke as a joke. But, alright, let's see what happens here. Um. Oh, okay. Uh, yeah. I think I killed him. Alright. So. I am going to do this. I want to be safe since I'm super low on HP, but this is a pretty good turn. I think the next, the two turns after this is the turn I'm looking for. Yeah, okay. Maybe that's why um, the video got cut a little bit weird, but it's okay, it's okay. All right, 383, no, 393. Oh man, that's pretty good. Okay, I think I'm gonna do this. He doesn't need to get a super, he'll be fine. And then let these guys get supers. And this should kill him. Either that or it's next turn because. Ow. Um. Anyways, I just want to see how much damage he'll do against um a STR unit rather than like, you know, an AGL unit because obviously type advantage. It'd also be really nice if he got a crit too. Okay, let's see. Go Han and Go Ten. Let's just do this. Hmm. Yeah, I'm so glad I got these guys. I, I can't stress enough how much, how happy I am that I got them. They're just, like, lifesavers. Okay, this is going to be really dangerous, but I think I'm going to do this. And then that. And then... Alright, yeah. I'm going to hope for the best. <sighs> Alright, well, that didn't work out, but... He did a hunt. He did 1.7 million, so... I'm just going to make a cut here. Alright, so here's what I think about him. His attack and defense plus 9 at the start of turn is really nice. His high, his high HP stat and defense is going to make him really interesting as an easy A. Him having 110% attack when performing a super attack basically is nice. Him raising defense is also pretty good. So, he's overall solid. And remember to turn on post notifications, like, subscribe, and I'll see you guys next time.